Friends, I come to you today not just as a colleague, but as someone who shares in the important work that we do. In these tough times, when the going gets rough, we sometimes need to be reminded as to why we are truly here. Within these sacred borders, we are the voices that people hear when tragedy strikes. We are the lights that guide them through unimaginable darkness. We are the calm during the constant storm of life. As we sit in that room, yes, we face challenges. And yes, it can be overwhelming at times. But it is in these moments that we truly find strength. Every call we answer and every life we touch shows the power of our work, our care, and our commitment to the betterment of mankind. I want you all to remember something. This is not just something we do. It's something we are. We are part of something far bigger than ourselves. We do not do it for the fame. We do not do it for the fortune. And God knows sometimes life isn't fair. We spend all of our times behind the curtain, unseen, but heard. Together, we have built something so special. We have saved lives and brought comfort to those in need. We are more than just coworkers. We are indeed a team who share an unbreakable bond. Every day, I urge you to stand strong. Like a river to the sea, we overcome all obstacles. We have to, for we don't have a choice in the matter. Failure is not an option. Let us also remember those happy times, the late nights we've shared, those moments of respite, the laughter that lifted our spirits, and the bonds that grew when we faced difficult times. The memories, good and bad, are what have kept us moving forward. I have had to learn for myself that quitting is never the answer. We pick up the pieces, those pieces of our broken selves, and we move on. That's what makes us great. Remember these words. When you feel like quitting, just remember why you started in the first place and it all becomes clear. Let's see these challenges as chances to grow and to lean on each other. Each of you shines bright and together we are the heartbeat of safety and the security of our communities. These people count on us to answer those calls. We are the beacon of light for that shining city on the hill. As we look to the future, let us pay tribute to those who are with us and let us pay tribute and remember those we have lost along the way. But for the grace of God go I. Let our voices rise in harmony, knowing that our work makes a real difference. Remember, don't follow a worn out path. Instead, blaze a new trail. Let us walk these paths together with strength and purpose. Let us face these storms as one. We will shine through, for together there is nothing we cannot accomplish. We do not quit, not now, not ever. From this desk, the pleasure is mine. With all that said, and I mean every word, may God bless you, may God bless your families, and may God continue to bless the United States of America. Good day and good night.